What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another hockey card video. Today I have some hockey cards for you from another eBay mystery pack. Now, you guys know why I do the eBay mystery packs is because, in my opinion, there are a lot of fun to do here on the channel, but I have been getting some really great cards out of mystery packs. So today is a new eBay seller that I'm using, and the stuff that I got from him is incredible. They're $5 for one card, so I didn't just get one. I got four, so that is $20 that I spent for these four cards. I think it was worth it. Let's check them out. So up first is a Sidney Crosby Tim Hortons card. Now it's the game day action card, and in my opinion, this card alone might not be worth the $5 I paid for it. However, I'm a huge fan of Sidney Crosby, and I know I did not collect this year, which is $19.20 for Tim Hortons cards. So this one here is going in my personal collection, so I'm 100% fine with it. This one here, I think, is awesome. I love getting Sidney Crosby cards. I'll just place this over here for now. The next card is a Young Guns for Cooper Marotti. Not 100% familiar with this player. However, I love the Oilers, and for an Oilers card, it looks pretty clean and crisp. I do like that. Again, this is... 1819, which honestly I did not collect much that year. Any of the young guns that I've received are ones that I've gotten either from eBay mystery packs or I purchased them straight off of eBay. So that one is a nice one because I do like getting young guns. I just don't get to collect them as much. And the next card here is a Marky Rookie foil, which is the Platinum Opeachy. So all of them look like this. I think it is amazing. I love getting marquee rookie cards. I like the Opeachy Platinums. I think the first year I was collecting when I was getting everything, Upper Deck Series 1, 2, Opeachy, Opeachy Platinum, Artifacts, literally everything. I loved the most the Opeachy Platinum. So this is a nice card for me. But the best card that I got from this mystery pack, so these are $5 each, so $5, $5, $5. The last one here, which was also $5, which I am shocked because his ad in the description did state the possibility of getting cards like this. I actually received one, which I thought was awesome, and I love this card. And that is a jersey card numbered out of 50. This is a Panini timeline for Adam Foot. National Treasures, which is awesome because it's a Quebec Nordics card, which I personally collect them. I've been getting more and more Nordics cards. So this one here I thought was really, really cool to receive from a mystery pack that costs $5 each card. I looked up the value for this one and it's valued at right now $20 on average on completed eBay comps. So that is really awesome to see. I love Quebec Nordic cards. I don't get them too often because I don't collect usually that era. I like collecting the newer cards. This one here, however, is Panini from 1314, which is really cool. And even though the jersey uh, patch inside is white, which usually I'm against, you guys can barely tell just because it is white. It's the seam of his jersey. So it's a seam card, which I think is awesome. So I got a numbered card out of this. This card alone is worth... Uh, valued at $20. I paid $20 for everything. Like I said, some of the other cards might not be worth the $5 I paid, specifically speaking the Sidney Crosby card. I'm not sure what exactly it's worth. I'll have to look up the value, but this card here is the best one I received. So because he is such a great guy, I was messaging him when I had questions. He was responding almost instantly. I did order four more cards from him, so another $20, and I told him I was going to show them out, but I'll leave it linked down below off for his eBay store, and I will hopefully put it somewhere on the video, his name, so you guys can see it. I'm really happy with this. This one is a nice card for my personal collection, and I'm really happy. I like all these cards because all of them are going to be staying in my personal collection. However, really, really like this numbered out of 50 card. He also states in the description that... You are going to receive one card, but it could be a rookie card or an insert card like these, or a numbered card, jersey card, auto card, or a chase card for a top 
player. So I'm really happy with what I received and I'm going to order more. I've already ordered four more from him. I'll show you guys those next time as well. But I'm hopefully going to try to save up to get his $25 mystery pack, which includes three cards, and his $50 mystery pack, which includes four cards. I think that would be a blast, but I want to see what I get from him in the next order because as you guys know from mystery packs from eBay sellers, a couple times that I ordered from them the first time, I got some really great stuff. The next couple times I ordered, I didn't get much. So before I order the $25 pack or $50 pack, I want to make sure it's almost consistent with some great stuff I'm getting from him. So I know it's worth the $25 or $50 that I put down for later ones. You guys know I don't like collecting the blaster boxes and I don't purchase any of the other boxes anymore often other than SP Authentic for $19.20 because I love those cards. But the reason for that is because I get a lot of base. And the base goes on my eBay in $2 mystery packs. But since I honestly have a lot of insert cards that I've received that I don't have room for in my collection, because either it's not something I PC or it's not something I really collect, I'm going to be hopefully putting together inserts, which may include uh, insert mystery packs, which may include jersey cards, auto cards, numbered cards, uh, other inserts that I don't collect. So I want to just in turn, just like this guy's doing, giving back to people so I'll purchase or I'll have them on eBay probably for five dollars and I'm not sure how many cards I'll include but I have to go through my hockey cards and see what else there is and post on my eBay. If you're wondering what my eBay is it is real takedown I believe it's all lowercase real takedown no spaces and yeah so I'm gonna leave this video here hope you guys enjoyed I'm definitely gonna be ordering from him in the future hopefully a few more times because this is a great card in my opinion and it's gonna be displayed for sure. See you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.